Hey Geeks, Jim from uh, MajorGeeks.com coming for you from the fully disclosed bunker location at MajorGeeks.com headquarters. I wanted to share with you a problem today that I solved and I'm very excited about so I wanted to talk to some people who would care. Uh, the problem I had is I had an external backup drive, a Seagate external backup drive, that when I went to check out the data, I got this. Uh, F drive is not accessible, parameters is incorrect. Uh, that's gonna, that basically tells you that you can't get to your photos anymore, son. Reading a number of documents, I tried the solutions they would offer, including F disk with uh, recommended parameters, you know, like this, and nothing was ha helping at all. I did run across the, another document from Ezus that said that their data recovery wizard could handle this problem specifically. I installed Ezus data recovery wizard and it did see the drive that was in question, but it just kept spinning and spinning and spinning. It didn't they recover the data, nothing worked. Uh, until I had the idea of maybe taking the, the drive out of the enclosure. Biggest problem there is with the Seagate drives, getting into the enclosure was, was a bit difficult. Uh, my life was saved by uh, Davy Danny here, who I'll link to his video. Uh, he showed a very easy way to get in, pull out the drive, and then I dropped it in my trusty Sabrent uh, drive dock and was able to get that uh, data out. I'll link to these in the description so you can see what I was using. But, what you know, once I did that, put it in the dock, Isis was easily able to see the data and organize it and use it so I could recover it. I tried a number of different recovery softwares to see if they could do it as well, some with with some success, but really Isis was, was the best of breed here. What's nice though is with Isis, uh, their first two gig is free. So you're going to recover two gig worth of data for free and they'll, uh, you know, no harm, no foul. The, for me, I clearly have more than two gig of data. So they kindly pop up a 40% off coupon here, which I will take advantage of to get the rest of it off. But as you can see here, it lines up your drive, the images of the drive. And this is the problem child, you know, right here. That's my problem child is the lost partition. And, you know, it's significant in size. So all you have to do is click it and it will then start scanning the drive for what is recoverable. Now, an important note I suppose I should make is I did not format this drive first. Isis says that they can recover from formatted drives but it's going to make it more difficult. And when you're looking for data recovery, you want to not write to the drive you're trying to recover as little as possible. You just don't want to write to that drive because it's going to overwrite that section where this file is, and then it's unrecoverable forever. So that's a, that's a little note. And again, I did pull it out of the enclosure. So the, the problem was caused by the enclosure itself, I believe. I'm not Sure, but there you go. And so here it starts chugging through and looking at the data it can collect. And as it goes through, it sorts them. So here's some bitmap files. And you can preview some of them anyway. You can preview what they are. You say, hey, do I really want that back? Right? Um, maybe it's something I, I just don't want. You know, some, some are previewable, some are not. Good Lord, who is that? Oh, that's me. Dudes, don't share that one. That's, yeah. If we all could forget that star. But here's some of my, my kids' pictures growing up. And these would be stuff I, I wouldn't want to lose with the, the child and the dog, right? So I'm willing to, to pay the upgrade fee. So once this is done scanning, or even mid-scan, you can just simply select the files you want to restore and recover. And I'm going to ignore this. Error. I'm living on the edge. You recover it and you can put it to wherever. It's going to recover them. It's going to link you to them. 
open it up. I didn't do any of that. It was all automatic. Brings you to the location, tells you what's there, and you can go in and look and see at your files that you've recovered right on your drive, and then re back them up. So, this is fantastic. It saved me a tremendous amount of time, tremendous a lot of aggravation, and really a, a, a great amount of disappointment because uh, there are a bunch of family photos and family movies and things that I just can't get back. So, uh, thank you, Isis. I'm going to be happy to, to, to pay the fee. It's not This isn't a paid endorsement. So if you want to, Isis, pay me as an endorsement, that's fantastic, too. So just get a hold. I find people get a hold of your people or something. But anyway, there you go. That's how it's done. Uh, it really was easy as pie. I'm, they really can do what they say they can do and, you know, enjoy. I hope this saves you uh, some trouble and gets those family photos back for you. Uh, enjoy your day, pound that subscribe button, and thanks for listening. See you next time.